people hello everyone it's people's show your show my show everyone show it's people's show oh, oh. it's people's show how are you guys doing at home hope you started doing all the sightseeing hope you started going out yeah 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 as for me i'm still checking it out through my window <laughs> You're welcome to my channel and if today is your first time yay i'm celebrating you and i'm giving you a thumbs up thank you for tuning in thank you for tuning in and if you're already a subscriber thank you thank you for always being here and on today's episode we're going to have an interesting time together we're going to have a sweet time together and we're going to be talking about success how successful are you are you successful are you we're going to be finding out and I'm gonna go in on a short break now. Please don't go anywhere. I will be right back after this short break. Ta -da. You're welcome back to my channel. <laughs> You're welcome here. Let's go straight to the business of the day. Today, we're gonna to be talking about success. You know, I've never met anyone who wants to fail. I have never met anybody, I've never met anyone who wants to fail in life. Have you met such people? I've not met such people. Please, if you have, if you have met such people, let me know in the comment section. So success is predictable, just like failure is predictable. Some people will sometimes say that the greatest enemy of success is failure. I don't believe that school of thoughts because the greatest enemy of success is not really failure, it's the fear of failure. Some people would have been successful today, some people would have been so astounding and be so successful that everybody wants to emulate. But because of fear, because of fear, they don't want to try new things, because of fear, they don't want to invest, because of fear, they don't want to do what they were born to do. So they will be afraid. So the success is not about making a lot of money. It's not about having a lot of money in the bank because people feel that oh, when you are successful, oh, it means you have a lot of wealth, it means you have a lot, you have accumulated a lot of things. Success is not having a lot of money or it's not just about having a lot of friends, it's not just about having a lot of money in the bank, it's not all about having a lot of accolades. You know, it's not all about that. And success is not comparing what you have done with what others have done success is not measured by what others have done or what others have achieved or what you have done more than others you don't measure success that way success is simply measured by and compared to what you have done those things that you have done right now those things that you have achieved right now you compare it to what you could have done what you should have done that is how you measure success success is not measured by what you have done or what you have done more than others is measured by what you should have. What you what, what can you do more compared to what you have done? What can you actually do more compared to what you have already done? Success is measured by what you are capable of doing compared to what you have done. Success. I have different definition of success. Success is discovering your purpose and completing it before you leave this head. Completing it before you leave this world. That's what success is all about. Knowing your purpose and completing it before you leave this world. So it's not, you, don't, you don't measure success by other people. You don't measure success by what you have done more than others. No, you measure success by how you fulfill your purpose before you leave this head. Fulfilling your purpose before you leave this world. That's what success is all about. Sometimes we compete with other people because we feel we do better than them and that's what makes us a success. The person is driving a very expensive car and you just see this person on the road that is hawking on the street and you feel you are a success. Success is not about who starts first. Success is to finish because you have started. So you will always find somebody who you are, who you, who you are better than. You will always find somebody who is lesser than you maybe in some things all human beings are supposed to be equal but because of some settings some certain things maybe some people cannot afford some things and others can some some people have, have achieved some physical wealth and others don't even have any so the people who have achieved so much wealth or so much um, um, um properties don't feel they are successful no that is not how you quantify success it's not about who started first is to finish because you have started. That's what success is all about. Success is purpose fulfilled. It's just like a fish were 
they were created to swim. The birds were created to, to fly. Find out what you were created for and fulfill it. That is success. That is what success is all about. It's not about the, 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 uh, the things. It's not, just, it's not just about the things you acquire. It's about finding what you were born to do and fulfill it. It's just like an egg trapped in a bed. If the bed was born and, it, and it never, the bed never flew, it means that bed is a failure. Success is making it to the end of why you were born, of why you were created. That is success. Success is making it to the end of your purpose. Every seed is a potential success. So if, okay, just like watermelon, the end of the watermelon, the, the watermelon, first of all, you see it as a seed. Then when you plant it, it becomes a watermelon. So the end, the, the success of that seed is the fruits. So that's success. That's how every human being is. We are all seed, but you have to become fruits. Then when you become fruit, you become a success. That's when you become successful. Success is predictable. Failure is predictable. To be successful, you have to, you have, to have a plan. Success is planned for. Failure is planned for. Some people might not believe it, but if you, if you don't plan for success, then the next thing is failure that will come your way. So success and failure is planned for. So that is why we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, January, February, March, different years because everything on earth is planned. So you must have a plan for you to be a success and for you to be successful. You must have a plan. I got a plan. Do you have a plan? For you to be successful, you have to have a plan. And that plan determines everything. It determines the kind of friends you keep. It determines the kind of place you go. It determines where you find yourself. The type, type of things that will, take, that will make you successful. The, type, the types of things that, that you allow to come your way. So everything goes with plan. For you to be a successful person on earth and in the world today, you must have a plan. Anyone without a plan will just fail. So you have to know your purpose. Your purpose will choose your friends for you. You will have friends who are negative, who are there to make you unsuccessful. You will have friends who, when you bring up your vision or things you want to do before them, they get all, all, all the, the next vibe you get from them is negativity. So you won't have such friends. So if you want to be successful, you also have to know the reason why you were born on earth. You also have to know the reason why you were born on earth, why you are here, and what you are living for. So you must have a plan. You must have a purpose. Success is purpose fulfilled. And you must know why you are here. And you must fulfill your purpose. Success in life is not about carrying fine bags, wearing fine shoes, driving the best car, or dressing up cute and sweet. Success in life is about fulfilling your purpose. Doing what you were born to do. That is what success is all about. Doing what you were born to do. Doing what you were created for. It's just like a piano. You have a piano and you, you put it in your, in, the, in your city room or in your house just to decorate your house. It will definitely have beauty to your house. The, the, the piano is beautiful. It will definitely have beauty to your house. It will definitely have a good concept in your house. But the piano is not fulfilling its purpose. That is not what it was born to do. That is not what it was created for. So the piano will just be there not being fulfilled. That's not success. But the piano will be successful if it's actually played. If it's actually adding value to someone's voice. If it's actually played for the purpose that it was created for. Success is simply being what you were born to be. Oh, you are a success. I am, I am, I'm, I'm, I'm doing what I was born to do. So, we have come to the end of this episode today. <laughs> Hope you had a nice time. And if you like this video, if you like this episode, please don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to click, touch, and um, patch. <laughs> The, 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 the button and if you haven't subscribed please no subscribe don't leave here without subscribing don't do that don't and let me
me know what you think about this episode. Let me know what you think about this episode. I want to hear from you. I want to hear success, successful gist from you. And promise me you're going to stay happy. Promise me you're going to have a good time throughout this season. And see you in the next episode. See you on Tuesday. Bye.